So, uh, that thing with the recording happened again where it just randomly decided to not record on me despite the fact that it was telling me at the time that it did, but luckily I was smart enough to decide to keep multiple saves and so I was able to go back and redo this part for the camera. So all you're missing is me coming back from uh, doing the statue thing and talking about how I could go to the arena, but I decided that I'm not going to go to the arena and fight and kill people, risk my own life and take the lives of others just to get information when I could just do it at a casino just by talking to people and hopefully save some bloodshed. So for that reason I decided to come to the casino and not the arena. And I did try to do the Fine Junior's hideout because I thought that that was going to his house that, uh, that Dick, Dick's fart. Dick, I can never remember his name, damn it. But I thought it was, that would point me to the house that he has that Dick guy told me about. Dickstra, that's it, that Dickstra told me about. But I started to go there and it actually was leading me into Cleaver's hideout. Which led me to believe that Find Horse and Junior's Hideout was associating with Cleaver, which I am trying to not do because I don't want to uh, don't want to potentially get uh, Junior killed before I find him and get to talk to him and all that. So, yeah, here we are at the casino. Even here. Same reason anyone comes here. Play a bit, have a good time. Invite only, mate. Shit's out of luck. I think you're about to let me in. By all means, please. And you, wish me luck. Luck be with you at the tables. Hmm. <laughs> it would be so cool to be able to do that. Well, I guess upstairs isn't pleasant. <coughs> so it was like play cards, and I was like, oh. I was kind of hoping I'd just be able to talk to people, but I also kind of figured that it would come to that. Cards lining up today? A mutant? What the hell's a witcher doing here? See any drowned dead? Or other shit sits around here? Not hunting shit sits tonight. Looking for the owner of this establishment. Oh, someone asked after him yesterday. Who? You know, I don't know. They crushed his head before I could get a good look. Man's swimming with the fishes now. Horson's always been touchy. But this, this is going too far. And then this is what confused me. Really gotta talk to the owner. Know where I can find him? I don't know, squat. Wait a moment. Gentlemen! This here rogue wishes to speak to the owner. Any of you know where Junior is? And he's an ass. So then this happened. And this is where we pick up in the next one. But real quick, I want to try this because this is something I haven't really ever made use of. Okay, so... Boom, that is super useful. Huh? And then basically this happened. Ooh. 
Uhu. And that was that. Good gosh. So yeah, it slows down time. Not done yet. All right, I guess let's keep the ball rolling then. Oh, there was an upstairs. There was an upstairs. Well, so much for not fighting. <laughs> For all the good that did me. Oh, hello. That might have been easily missed. List of debtors. See about this sword first. Hello. Chance to dismember, chance to freeze. It's a steel sword, cool. And it does do better damage. 127 to 155. 119 to 145. Yeah, it does. Alright, boy. We got us a new sword. It's two bonus experience from humans and non-humans. Oh hell yeah. I did put the lesser attack runestone on this one, though, but... I mean, look how many runestone slots this one has. Yeah, boy. Check that out. That's so frustrating. Do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> Adelbert, Zimmer, Gwynhuis, Lettuce, Billace, Segamore, Prokop, Rico, Mortimer, Schwindel, Stan, the Gries, Aardvark, Von der Boltimer, Aardvark? You alive? Don't finish me. Don't intend to. Who the hell are you? I heard screaming downstairs. It's all right now. Will you help me? What's your name? Rico. Rico Meyersdorf. Why are you here? 
What's it look like? I came here to sit and think. God. All right. Clever and tough's not working for me. They took me for one of Bedlam's moles. Are you? Well, kinda. Yeah. So what have you kinda learned? Paulson's working hand in glove with the Redanians. I don't know the details, but he's on their side. And that's all I know. Stay a while? Why would I tell him to... I really don't understand what this means. Is this literally telling him to like stay in this building? Or... Oh, I don't know. Get out of here, dude. Take care of yourself. Thanks. I'll lay low until things settle down. Bedlam will learn you help me. See him. He's sure to reward you. Wonder if Dijkstra knows Junior's made a deal with the Redanians. Honor among thieves. I'll collect a reward. Oh, why not? What is alchemy paste for? Uh, excuse me. Excuse me, Paul. Goodness, they really put him through the ringer, didn't they? I got a new sword. Yay. Whoops. I ah, forget it. Alrighty. Hmm. I'm wondering if I maybe want to try to do this too, though. I guess we'll see what developments come from this, and then if I still have to do that, then we'll do that. Um. Oops. Where is this? Oh, here. We'll go do this first, and then we'll go get that. Actually, I came here thinking I had subject myself to playing cards in order to save lives that didn't need to be taken. <laughs> And you see what happened. Oh, I probably could have taken a thunderbolt also, now that I think about it. So yeah, that blizzard potion probably won't do me a whole lot of good until I get it upgraded to make the slowdown longer. Ew. Rolling upstairs is fun. <laughs> I love it when you can do that in games. Because it doesn't make any sense. Aww. Excuse me. 
seriously, can you people not see where you're going? Hi, Horson's henchmen. Don't mind me. Oh, but, as I was saying, OCPD. Oh gosh, I can't... I'm disappointed in myself. I already forget what it stands for. Obviously, obsessive compulsive something that starts with a P disorder, but I don't remember what the P is. Hmm. That's gonna bug me. As was something else that I've now forgotten. Which I suppose is a good thing. But, uh... Yeah. OCPD, whatever the P stands for, is basically... I mean, I don't know if it'd be correct to call it a subtype of, uh, of OCD, but... It's basically just an extreme... Extreme perfectionism, kinda. Like, to the degree that it causes significant, uh, significant psychological, psychological distress or, uh, or life hindrance. Got a minute? I do. What do you want? Wiley. Orson Jr. He's working with Radovid. Huh? If this is reliable information, Orson's neck deep in shit. Um. You fallen out with Redania? My sympathies have nothing to do with this. Orson wiped his ass with our agreement. That's betrayal, regardless of his current allegiance. Need someone who can get me in to see Jr. You must still have some contacts among the Redanians. I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian, former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell? Vernon Roach. He's holed up with his men in the camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. Well, gee. That was unexpected. Huh. Golly. I guess I'm gonna go see Vernon Roach. Huh. Um. So he's down by Oxenford. Yeah. Oh goodness. Oh, gee. Hmm. As much as I'd like to go see him, I wonder if maybe I should... Uh, should do this to see if I can go somewhere else that's closer. Hmm. Well, I guess I have been in the city a while. It could be nice to step back outside. But let's probably start by finishing this up, actually. Well, I mean, let's start with this. Oh. Oh, what's this? Geralt entered the Novigrad bathhouse. He happened to walk in on a meeting of the heads of the city's criminal underworld, becoming an unwitting participant in their conversation, blah, blah, blah. In particular, when it was a blah blah blah, they say hands of plenty make for light work, and Geralt had every reason to believe this applied to gang warfare as much as it did to cleaning a barn, so he gracefully accepted the gangster's offer. Alright, well, let's start with this for now. Hmm. I thought I was gonna not go with Cleaver, though. Oh well, we'll see what happens. Oh, right, almost forgot. Really? It's 
really... <sighs> I just kind of assumed that there would be a character entry for Vernon Roach after that. <sighs> well, to anybody who has not seen anything of the second game and doesn't know who he is, Vernon Roach is a an army commander in the Redanian army as... Uh, did oh my gosh, I already forget what his name is, Dick. Dickvar or something? That guy. As he said. And, uh... In the second game, when Geralt is arrested for the accusation of killing King Foltest, which Letho actually did, Vernon Roach basically... Roach is the one who questions him, and then believes you that you're not the one who did it and essentially helps 